Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel and today I am going to show you a couple of my babies. Guys, make sure you are subscribed to this channel. If you're not, go ahead and subscribe now. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad so that you can be one of my Lolas. <laughs> so, all right, Lolas. Um, let me start from left to right. You guys know your left from your right. If not, raise your hand that you normally, you know, do the pledge allegiance to the flag. Um, and that's your right. And now we're going to go to your left. Okay, you guys got that left to right. Okay, so from the left. There is Bryson, which is Alex by Claire Teller. Um, he's a partial silicone baby, meaning that his head, his arms, and his legs are silicone. His body is cloth, like a reborn baby. And in the middle is Phoebe Pooh. That's my Cinnabon. And little Miss Cinnabon is um, full body baby. Oh, full body baby. She is the Willow Awake by Claire Tellum and mean her whole body is silicone and she's soft silicone, very soft silicone. <laughs> and um, then you have little Mr. Micah and Micah is Warren by Laura Tuzu Ross and he is a reborn baby, he is vinyl meaning he is his arms his head his legs are vinyl and his body is cloth um so in reality of it all he is firm um not quite like store-bought dolls but he's more firmer like them versus the silicone um so there is a difference all of the babies were painted by me um and so yeah so so that's bryson phoebe and micah okay and so i think um bryson is 19 inches i believe micah is 18 inches and Phoebe is 22 inches. So, um, yeah, so she's, she's the longest and the bigger of them all. Let me see if I can lean my camera over. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, wait, that didn't work. Let me see if I take it off of here so that you guys can see them, an overview of their legs. Let's see. So if you look at them like that, so in all actuality, um, Micah and Bryson are actually not too far apart as in inches. And this is again why I always say it doesn't really matter when people be like, oh, it's 19 inches, it's 18 inches because 19 inches and 18 inches, they can all look very different depend on the medium, depend on the sculpting depending on how you stuff the cloth body. It's just so many different variables to these babies. It's very hard. So to say something is not as described or whatever, that can really be a very tricky thing. So now I'm gonna take you guys over to crib number two and take us some light. Give us light. Um, and so over here, Lord, what have I done? Okay, let's see, let's see. All right, all right, all right. We getting there, we getting there. Getting some light. So over here is, there we go. Oh my God, my babies. <laughs> so over here we have Phoenix. Phoenix Bear is my toddler. He is Lim by Bonnie Brown. And um, then you have Dallas, and Dallas is Dallas by Don McLeod. And the um, both painted by me, both rooted by Sentimental Babies. Um, and 
I've been working with her for years on rooting and I just absolutely love how she is able to get what I asked for. Like I can give her a picture of real baby and a look that I want and she's able to get what I'm asking for. So I love that. And so usually if I do um, a vinyl in the in most cases they are rooted by her that is my go-to um, and then I am now working on trying to root myself for um, silicone but also vinyl I've been I haven't had a chance to stop and work because it's my personal baby and so as you guys know I have to take care of everything else before I get to that because rooting is very time consuming so I can't necessarily do that for myself which is why Bryson will probably be bald until summer next year who knows but anyway we'll see um I've been doing really good at taking at least like a half a day or a few hours out of the day or in the middle of the night and painting for myself so um on my personal babies and then just the rest of the day and time I'm working on my custom order. So I am trying not to lose myself in my work because otherwise it's going to feel like work and then I'm not going to like it. So that's where I'm at with that. So, um, so yeah, so anyway, I haven't had much mini toddlers, um, in my collecting days. Or life <laughs> and I have to say you know we were having this this uh, conversation in the comment section and I have to say that I am NOT a real toddler toddler person um, however um, I absolutely adore um, my my Phoenix and he's actually believe it or not like my favorite baby like he's my very favorite baby at the moment and it's it's different you know but I you know I love all my babies and each one of them is something special about them but I've not had a toddler that I've been so in love with and so you know it's fun to dress them but not only that it's just I don't know it's just different and it just I don't know he just really gets me I don't know so I, I, I love me some Phoenix um, and he's pretty, he's a pretty big boy. And I did actually have a custom made body for him um, from uh, Jamie Lennox so that he could be a little bit bigger than the body that he came with because I wanted him to be a bigger boy. And I thought that, you know, with his head size and his limb size, it was, it would be good. And and it did. It work it works good and I really like it. So that's that. He does have dark brown eyes. So his eyes aren't black, but they're very dark and they are dark in person as well. Um and Dallas, Dallas is a baby that I do have her available for adoption, but <laughs> I haven't had time to sit down and do a um, put together eBay listing and also I am actually kind of enjoying her in my collection right now so I'm not really pushing the sale of her right now so I don't know that she will continue to be available much longer um, and you guys know how I am I'm very indecisive when it comes to letting my babies go especially if they don't sell like the first day and that's I know that's crazy I I don't know. Some of them I just get attached to. Some of them I be determined to sell. So, um, she has had a lot of inquiries. Um, but she is still here. So, and I just, I don't know. I just really, just really, really love her. So, um, her price was $1,050 shipped in the U.S. And, um, I'm not adjusting that and I'm not changing that. And so... You know, everybody have their, you know, price points of where they're willing to spend and what they're not willing to spend. And then, you know, also as from a seller perspective, we have our price points of what we're set our prices at and what we're willing to sell at and what we're 
you know willing to adjust to and she is not going to be adjusted so that is her price and it's firm um so anyway um that is that and now i'm gonna try my hardest to get you guys over to my new girl and this is gonna be challenging i have a lot of stuff sitting in my chair because i was folding clothes and putting away things that my babies had wore um so let me see if i can get over there so i'm going to take away the light because she's going to need light and i don't know really the color of her eyes someone brought it to my attention once again girl that is not blue so i think when i ordered the eyes they said blue gray so I just said blue but I think they're in between a blue and a gray okay now y'all leave me alone I don't know my colors and that's fine some of you guys don't know your colors either now how about that I don't go telling you guys that that is not red hair that's orange hair I'm <laughs> just kidding let me stop but for real, I didn't know the color. I was like, uh. So, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, this is unedited footage, y'all, guys. This is behind the scenes. Do 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 do. Do do. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, dum dum. Dum Okay, this is not working because it's lit no light out in the day. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna see if I can roll this down to this little girl. Let's see if we can get the light down to her. All right, we getting better. Uh-oh, and she got those little dang on birdies. You know, I love them things for props, but they are so annoying. I'm gonna move that in a second, hold on. It's so annoying when you're trying to take a picture or trying to show the baby, can't see anything. Now. Oh my god. So anyway, this is this is awkward. Let's see. Da da. Let's see. Did that work? <laughs> Alright. So <laughs> Yes, I just threw that on the floor. Um gosh why is it okay so if i hold this up like that you guys can see a little bit more so she is see that's her she's 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 a good size baby um i put her on those little shoes because <laughs> i didn't want her footsies to be cold so anyway she is maggie and i'm thinking about leaving her name as maggie <laughs> Oh my god, like totally she looks like a Maggie. Like that name totally like suits her. Like I think the sculptor like knew what she was doing when she came up with the name Maggie. Because I can totally see her like sucking, 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 sucking her pacifier. Like the little baby from Bart Simpson. I just think that she just is just a baby that's just full of wonder and like I think she like you know would be one of those babies that just like always stretching her eyes and looking around and being nosy and every time she hears sound she's jumping and turning around and what's that type look and I think you know every time her binky falls she's quick trying to put it in her mouth so I need to get her some passy clips because she's totally a passy baby and I think she us, you know, she's a crawler. I think she would be like crawling all over the place right now and pulling up on stuff. Right, poo poo? Oh my gosh. Like I am so in love with her. Like for real. Like if you see her up if for sale, like in a month ago, know that this was my feeling in I mean like a month from now. Like then just know this was my feeling this moment like don't be like oh you said you loved her okay for real she ain't going up for sale but <laughs> i don't know why i had to do all that but i absolutely love her like love her love her you guys know that i've been obsessing over this kid for so long and you guys that was in the 
that are in the chat box know that there's some backstory about you know her and the susu and all that and stuff and i just really 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 love this sculpt and i i couldn't hold it anymore i said you know what i'm gonna paint my own i don't have time to you know just wait i i want her now and i had this vision in my head and i couldn't get it out and I had to challenge myself because there is a challenge with me when painting um, very light biracial, not going darker. It's weird because I don't do dark, very dark skin because I'm not as confident in it. But I don't, it's very hard for me to be, stay light, light. And for me... For my Caucasian babies, I either like a very, very milky white baby or a baby with a yellow tinge to her to her or him. And for Caucasian, I mean biracial, for my biracial babies, I really like them very light normally. Or, yeah. Because of the thin line between biracial and black babies, because babies, when they're born, in most cases, black babies are already so freaking light that they almost look like they are white. So there's just such a thin line between the biracial and the black babies, if that makes sense. I don't know. Anyway, I know I had to go into all that and break that down, but... I'm just saying I was very happy with the way her skin tone came out because I did not go too yellow. Say I did not go too yellow and I did not go too light. And so she's definitely, she's either a very tanned Caucasian baby. She could still be Caucasian actually, or she's definitely biracial. And if she was a, if she was a baby that was not black, I would have to say she would have to have some type of Italian or something in her to why she tans so well. Okay, I don't know. Child, don't get me to talk. Let me stop acting like I know. I don't know nothing about nothing. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. It's been a long video as a usual. I don't know why I've been so long-winded. Um, I'm going to do some shoulder videos for you guys when I learn how to shit my pie hole. But right now, I just love to talk. So you guys can either listen or click off after how many minutes you have allotted for me. Because some of y'all only can take five minutes of me. Some of you guys can take the whole day. Whatever floats your boat, jump on in and sail with it. Alright guys, bye.